Well, now that you've finished looking at these videos, you're probably wondering where should you go next. The first thing is get some books. I can't encourage you more to go out, find some books, go to Barnes & Noble, go to your local bookseller store, Walden Books, whoever you might have around, and peruse their computer section and find books that work for you that are about Ruby on Rails that will help you move your skills forward. You can sit with a book, go through it, take a look at some of the ones that are available online as the Rough Cuts. O'Reilly has their Safari books, which are a subscription service. The Pragmatic Programmers have their beta book program that you can use. So I can't encourage you more to go out and look at some of those books. Look in the working files. I have a list of books available that you should take a look at. Start a real project. I teach computer science computer programming and I can't emphasize more the power of having a real project to work on something where there's an expectation of the delivery of something it really gets your skills up to speed and kind of forces you in some way to do something if you're just playing around and dabbling that's fine but you're not going to get up to skill until you have a real project even if it's something your family's expecting or you've built up expectations that way it doesn't have to be for work necessarily but certainly it helps or if you want to actually be the next big internet success like dig or something like that go for it get involved in the community contribute some code get into irc put yourself out there a little bit to do that, you can also attend some conferences. There's RubyConf, there's RailsConf. Let's take a look here. RubyConf just was in June, so next year it'll be coming around again roughly the same time. I don't remember the exact dates. I think it was June 14th or somewhere around in there. Keep looking at this website, you'll see. I believe it's going to be in Portland next year, but you'll get to meet the core people uh, with Ruby on Rails from 37Signals. Look at RubyConf. RubyConf is coming up October 20th. You can see some powerful things that you can do there. Meet powerful people, in other words, in the Ruby community. The last thing on my little list was attend some training. There's lots of local training on the mail list. If you get onto the Ruby on Rails mail list, you'll see people announcing trainings all over the country. There's actually user groups, too, that are announced on there. I encourage you to get involved in those. Pragmatic Studios has a series of trainings that are available. They're often sold out uh, very quickly, so if you want to get involved, I'd watch and get in there pretty quick. So there's a lot of options you have to get involved in Ruby on Rails and get something done, get real.